Hello everyone. Uh, first of all, I want to thank you all for all the good wishes uh, that you send me during the last few days that I have some problems with the uh, infection. Uh, I will maybe tell you more about it in one of my next videos. Um, I'm better, much better, uh, but still not good enough to go to my happy place, to my studio, to paint. Uh, but I have some videos uh, um, that I, you know, yeah, I always film myself when I experiment, do things. So I will publish one of these videos and maybe you can learn something from my mistakes. Uh, maybe you will even like it, never know. Uh, and I hope that I will be back on track uh, next week. I bought some new products that I want to try. Uh, hopefully they will work, I don't know. <laughs> um, so just want, wanted to say thank you for all the prayers and positive vibes that you send me and Love you all. Enjoy the video. Hello from Slovenia again. Today I will play with a hair dryer and this paint art kind of it says chameleon but they are more like iridescent pigments and I have green white, gold and blue and black and I mix them with polyurethane satin varnish and my pouring medium that's why I hope for some kind of cell reaction and I will just play with it and I will tilt this will not be a, a Dutch pour, I will just play with paints and a hair dryer. So I poured in the green one and I will go around with that white gold. And my paints are on the tin side. And maybe I will add a little blue here in the middle and some blue around. I don't know why. This is just <laughs> freestyle. Because with the hair dryer, it's always a freestyle for me. I will pour some black around. And some black here in the middle. Maybe I should just steal that, like for the pearl pores, without the hair dryer, I don't know. I wish that you could tell me what you think. I don't think I should then pour black just on on top. So let's use my hair dryer.
I will definitely try this again, but just, you know, blow the black over and then spin it out and add more paint, of course. But let's see how this will dry, shall we? So here is the dry result. Uh, I hope that I will be able to catch all these colors. I wish that there would be a little more of the blue, but it's cool anyhow. So you can see green, gold, blue. I'm not quite happy with these sides um, because I didn't have enough paint but definitely got those pearl cells effect um, and I can't wait to try this again with a little more paint because you need it and a different approach because it was just like you know I don't know an experiment it wasn't meant to be a pearl pour at the beginning but sometimes just good to follow your instinct this white gold it's so interesting from one direction it's white and from the other is gold but it's hard to catch on camera but i love it because i love that there is kind of white too so i will say that i'm happy with this one definitely worth to play with those pigments again they are quite interesting so this was it for today and see you on the next one bye